Hey guys, Fieldcraft here, and today we're going to be doing the next issue of the RMS Titanic in in the build. So for this, you're going to need your issue 78. You're going to need your issue 78's box, some three-in-one oil, and your screwdriver set. I'm going ahead and getting my Allen key ready. We're going to go with the H2.0 Allen head. Set my Allen key here to the side just in case I need it too. And then we're going to go ahead and put the Titanic on its side and then I'm going to go ahead and open up the book All right. step one take the next section of the hole 78A and position it on the port side as shown above the screw hole in the tab on the forward end of part 78A aligns with the socket on part <clears throat> 64A, circled in yellow, or circled in white, right. And three screw holes in tabs on the upper edge of part 77A align with sockets on the lower edge of part 78A, circled in yellow. So we're going to go ahead and get our box open. Get our part out of the bag. There's our next section right there. L9. Let me get you right here. We're going to work on getting this part. And just like that. Okay. Turning the page to step two. Step two. Fix the whole section 78A to sections 64A and 77A with 4LM hexagonal headed screws. If they do not tighten fully, you can use washers 78B to add thickness and make the fastening more secure. Tighten the screws using the Allen key supplied with issue 15. Okay, so now we're going to need our screws and our washers. We need four washers. There's three. There's four. Then we need four screws. If I can ever get them out of the daggone bag. There we go. Well. Two, three, four. Okay. So now we're going to use our Allen key. We're going to use our three and one oil. Okay. 
Don't even want oil. I'm gonna go for the one that's right there. If I can get my screwdriver in there. Okay. Okay, that one's good. I'm going to get my next washer in place and then I'm going to get my next screw into the three-in-one oil Okay, that's secure. Gonna get my next washer. And I'm gonna get my next screw. Three and one oil. Okay, that's good. Get my next screw, which is my last screw, and then my last washer. I'm gonna go ahead and put the lid back onto the three in one oil. I missed that one. Try again. There we go. And that's not wobbly at all. So that's got that piece on there now. Let me just flip the ship up and turn it around and we'll look at it. Oh, holy moly, this thing's getting heavy. Okay, there we go. Here's our new piece that we just added. And this right here is actually up to the point where the ship broke in two. So we made it that far now into the ship where she broke in two. So this is the whole front half of Titanic that broke in two. We just got two more pieces to put on the other side. But anyway. Completed work. The next section of hull has been fitted to the upper port side of the assembly. But that's going to do it for this video. I hope y'all enjoyed and I hope y'all are doing safe during this troublesome times. And you all have a blessed one. And when I come back, we'll be doing the next issue of Titanic. But until then, goodbye.